Hey guys, Reese for we here. Welcome back to more Wolf Among Us. Oh wait, forgot. The subtitles keep this disappearing off. Don't know why they keep doing that. Click. TJ's so, over there. To I don't know here, right? what to Where is he? first or after, but let me know when you're ready to see the body. I, I want to be there. Buffkin, do you have a second? Of course, Miss Snow. Oh, I got to know. Mira, finish, cancel. What the hell are you doing? Don't even get started with me, Sheriff. What's going on? I saw what you did down there. Is that how you treat your prisoners? Hmm? I'd be lying if I said I didn't want to give Tweedledee a good smack after what he put me through. But what you did to him was way over the bloody line. You scared the shit out of me, little boy. He saw everything. Okay, Mr. Toad. Mouth. And what did you expect to see? I thought maybe I'd catch you on the shit up. But I saw something worse, didn't I? That's enough. Mr. Toad, I deeply regret the distress this has caused you and your son. But right now, we need to carry on with the investigation. I will be happy to speak with you about your concerns later, but you must understand how urgent this is. We need to talk to TJ. This ain't over, Big B. Man, Toad, what's your problem? Spying on us? TJ. It's alright. Are you ready to talk to Mr. Wolf? Watch yourself, Big B. You do anything to hurt me, boy. It's okay. Are you okay? Go ahead, TJ. I go swimming at night sometimes, in the river. I wasn't doing anything bad, I promise. Of course you weren't. We know you're a good kid, TJ. You're not in trouble. Just tell me what happened. I was there, under the big blocks. And I heard noisy feet. And when I hear that, I'm supposed to go underwater and stay real still and quiet. That's right, son. Then I saw... I... I saw the lady! <laughs> it's okay, son. Take your time. The lady... fell in. But, but she didn't have her head on. I thought, I, I thought she was going to pull me down too. Because, <laughs> because she had rocks on her feet and she kept falling down in the dark part. <laughs> Cinder blocks tied to her ankles. Is there more, TJ? Is it true? Do you know when people are lying? I heard you could do that. That's why you're the sheriff. Yeah, it's my special power. I always know when people aren't telling me the truth. Is there something else you want to say? Please, don't be mad. What is it, TJ? I, I didn't stay under the water. What? I know I'm supposed to, but I was scared. And, and I went to the top again. I couldn't help it. I gave you very specific rules. You have to stay quiet and out of sight or bad things can happen. I told you. You shouldn't have lied. I'm sorry. We'll discuss this when we get out. So you didn't stay underwater? I don't know if anyone saw me, but, but someone said, stop laughing. And then I was scared, and I went under for as long as I could. Wait. You heard someone? 
Yes. Why didn't you tell us before? I didn't want to be in trouble. Okay, TJ. I'm sorry. After I came up again, there was no one there. And I ran home, that's all. I promise. I want to go home. Okay, you can go. <laughs> Hmm. Interesting. Someone was laughing. Okay, son. You did a good job, kid. Come on then. That went about as well as I expected. <sighs> you want to go look at the body now? Hmm. But a minute. When you're ready. Let's see the medic here has to say. Hey, mirror. Hello, Big B. Nice to see you. What were you showing Mr. Toad and his son? Cinderella selling shoes, Rapunzel, Rose, and of course there's you. And I can't help note that you did not rhyme. Do try to stick to the rules next time. Yeah, I'll do that. The woodsman and I were fighting. Now I want to know where he's hiding. Well, that's helpful. Where can I find Tweedledum? Uh, that piece of scum. In a car somewhere. Okay, that's all of them. What is that? An assets. Maybe this has been harder on him than I thought. like not much has changed between me and Woody. I meant what I said, Snow. Beauty and Beast, always putting on a show for each other. <sighs> I will get to the bottom of this. So, check out anyone who fits that profile. You might start with Bluebeard. Right away, Miss Snow. Are you ready to examine the body now? Yeah. Oh my goodness! I almost forgot. What is it? Evidence. Come on. Witching well chamber, the wisdom, the Woodland building. Thank God I found the run button. Who asked for Snow White? That's my question. I didn't realize. You're gonna be okay. 
okay? You don't have to stay. I want to stay. I'll be fine. It's just a little strange. The glamour is so effective, it's invasive. But just do what you need to do. Looks just like Faith's dead. Did Dr. Swinehart ever get back to you about Faith? No. He said he wanted to run more tests. If the neck wound was the same, there might be a ribbon in her mouth, too. Anything? Nothing. So, it's not exactly the same. Can you close her mouth? Repeat. Thanks. You're welcome. That's weird. I don't wear a brooch like that. Maybe it really belonged to her. Not part of the glamour. Looks like something from the homelands. Buffkin, do you recognize these symbols? No, nothing I've seen before. She got your perfume right. How would she know? How do you know what perfume I wear? You can't fool this nose. Okay, next. Rope marks. She was tied up? They tied cinder blocks to her ankles. So she would sink. Oh. Track marks. She used Monday drugs? Looks that way. Pretty heavily, too. I hear they only go for the legs if they've used up the veins in their arms, or if they're trying to hide the marks. Anyway, it means it's not a perfect match to your leg, unless... Don't be ridiculous. Maybe she was trying to compensate with that perfume. Wait. If the glamour is supposed to make her look like me, shouldn't it be concealing things like track marks? That brooch, too. Why would it change everything else? I've never seen one this sloppy. It might be a cheap one, just to get the job done. The witches upstairs know what they're doing, that's why they cost so much. Unless someone is making glamours illegally? It's not technically illegal, miss. It's not encouraged for sure, but there aren't any laws specifically forbidding it. So there's some sort of black market for glamours? One would assume so. I imagine anyone with access to the proper books and training could theoretically produce a glamour. Yet another thing to worry about. Black market or not, it's a pretty good match. Look at that. The buttons aren't exact either. There's an extra one here. Her fist is clenched. So she fought back? No marks on the knuckles. Oh. Maybe she was grabbing something? Maybe. What are you doing? Only way to find out. Smash. Hey! Come on! Jesus, Bigby. What is it? Flowers. Yeah. You're right. These buttons are wrong. I wonder... What? No, do you mind if I, uh, open her coat? Bigby, just let me do it. We're making progress. Let's see what else we can find. I... Well, I certainly hope you're behaving yourself up here, now that you're done burning people. What have you found out? The glamour is defective. Defective? We are thinking it's black market. We should really be regulating this kind of thing. Yes. 
We should keep going. Are you wearing silk lingerie, Snow? Why do you want to know? I'm just trying to see if the clothes are exact. They're not. What is that? She had the perfume with her. Looks like someone picked it out for her. So, someone gave her instructions. I've seen things like this before. It's definitely magic, though witches don't usually craft objects these days. I don't think it's wise to fool around with that. It's some kind of black market magic. Who knows what it could do? We should have it looked at. Just to make sure it isn't dangerous. Don't you think? You may be right. One way to find out. Hmm. What? There's something in here. How do we open it? I think I can figure it out. Something to do with these rings here. Hmm. Someone must have taken this from my apartment. I, I noticed it was missing, but I didn't think... This was the last picture I had of Rose and me. My sister and I don't talk much anymore. Let me guess. It's my hair. Yeah. Who did this, Bigby? She's a troll? You gotta be kidding me. Yeah, she's a troll. Can we move on? Who is she? That wasn't there before. Who do you think she is? I don't know many trolls, I'm afraid. Should have left them all back in the homelands. You don't mean that, do you? Maybe Holly knows. The owner of the trip chart? No, she looks a little... Oh, no. What is it? It's not Holly. It's her sister. That's what I was going to say. She was reported missing, but it... I guess it just slipped through the cracks. We have to go tell Holly. Right. Who knows? She might know something about this. Who Lily was seeing. Well, certainly another troll. We should go. You can't go out there. Why not? It's too dangerous. Someone tried to kill you. Bigby, you can't let her go out there with you. You'd be putting her life at risk. If Snow wants to come with me, I'm not going to stop her. But we should leave now. You ready? Yeah. Hmm. So, Holly's sister Lily went missing, disguised herself as Snow, and someone